As COVID-19 cases soar, more people have been exposed and need to get tested. That is causing a huge backlog at testing sites, making it harder for people to find immediate openings in the metro. News 13's Rachel Knapp explains how long you'll have to wait. When Stephanie Cassidy's husband started to feel sick, he wanted to get tested for the coronavirus, but he would have to wait for that test. He was able to schedule a few days out at Expo New Mexico. The majority of Albuquerque's testing locations listed on the Department of Health's website require people to make an appointment. And for most places, they are booked the day of and the next day. When we made calls to check openings, some said they were booked through the weekend. So when Cassidy started coming down with symptoms, she immediately started her search to see what's available, but still came up short. The calendar only went out, I believe, three or four days. And if you clicked to schedule it, it said all further appointments are booked. So for people like Cassidy who aren't lucky in finding same day testing appointments available, they're essentially left with three options. Schedule an appointment, which could be a day or two away, drive to a site outside the city, or go to a clinic that doesn't require an appointment. But you might end up waiting in a long line outside in the cold. She went with that third option, waiting for more than three hours. A lot of people in the line were talking about the same issues of not being able to find testing or if they did, they had to wait. We found this large crowd outside a clinic on Zuni. Cassie says people who need to get tested should do their research by calling ahead and hope there's an opening if appointments are required. I would look at it right away before you start feeling really bad because it does take days to get appointments or hours waiting in line in the cold when you're not feeling well if you don't do that. Rachel Knapp, KRQE News 13. A Department of Health spokesperson says the state is working to expand COVID testing locations and reminds people if they start having symptoms or have been exposed to a positive person to self-isolate. We have a link that shows testing locations across the state on our website, krqe.com.